Hi, this is Andy, and I'm here to show you what Buck mobile invoicing looks like when integrated with someone like Stripe. So here we have created a Stripe account, and any merchant can go online and create a Stripe account in just minutes. And I'm going to show you what it looks like to tie in a Buck mobile invoice into a test account on Stripe. So here it is. I just created a 1999 invoice, and I sent it to myself just a minute ago. Let me show you my reports here. So I'll show you how this syncs up with my Stripe account. So I have uh, six paid invoices equaling $99. And up here on my Stripe account, you can see that my total processed volume is $99. I have some outstanding invoices as well. So one of those is a trim tree job for $19.99. So I'm going to go over to my phone here. So I just sent this invoice to myself. It's the $19.99 trim tree. So I'm going to go ahead and pay this invoice. All right, there we are. It's been paid. So now I'll go back, and as the merchant, I simply refresh here. And now you can see that it turns green, so it's been paid. And it says now that I have seven invoices that have been paid for $118.99. So back on Stripe, here we are. I'm going to have to refresh the page. And Stripe usually lags about a minute behind, but hey, it's fast today. So there it is. And it matches up. So I have $118.99, $118.99. And that is how Buck and Stripe integrate. Uh, we do this with any payment processor. It can be Authorize.net, CyberSource, First Data. All you need to integrate with Buck and your payment gateway is the keys. Those keys can usually be found in your account settings under API keys. And by getting the API keys, you can link your Buck mobile invoicing to your payment processor.